Big Old Ballet is performing the Nutcracker at the Kentucky Center through Sunday. Nearly 50 dancers and 100 children are part of the holiday show. WLKY's Christina Mora went backstage to see how the classic fairy tale becomes a reality. Well, I have several roles, uh, one being the uh, Sugar Plum Cavalier. Like many of the dancers at Louisville Ballet, Brandon Ragland is preparing for several different parts in the show. I actually have seven roles that I play, um, but one of which is the Sugar Plum Fairy, which is one of the most iconic roles. In a way, Katrina Sellers has been preparing for her part her entire life. You think back to being a little girl and watching the Sugar Plum Fairy on stage, and then you get to be that person. It's pretty, it's pretty neat. The show takes more than a month of prep work, in and out of the studio. I'll usually get to the gym around 7, 7.30, um, do a little bit light cardio to get my day started. I'll go to the gym and do some, a uh, little bit of cardio, get the blood flowing. For weeks, the dancers rehearse, breaking the ballet apart, step by step. Perfecting a show the audience has come to love. To perfect the technique, but also to make sure that the the soul of the ballet, that the story, is really true and um, really uh, accessible for the audience. That's when the dancers have time to really hone their technique, uh, focus really on themselves, on their bodies. The show is just as much a tradition and holiday staple for the dancers as it is for the audience. And when they finally take the stage, the payoff is worth the work. It's indescribable for me. Uh, it's a great feeling. For me, it's the kids. To hear the oohs and ahs and wows at the simplest things. Um, that makes the children happy. Christina Mora, WLKY News. Check out our website, WLKY.com, for times and dates to see the Brown Foreman Nutcracker.